We are back. We're here again. Coffee's so good. Thank y'all for watching. Welcome. Look, and Keurig coffee's nasty. Keurig coffee is like ground roaches put into a little plastic cup. It, Brenda probably filled up that, that container of water with some with, with her nasty hands. And then you just put that 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 environment killing turtle slaying cup, and and you just get this you just get this cup of you just get this cuppity cup of warm nothing. It's just hot water. Stop it! Stop it! Get a bean, grind it, put it in the grinder. Get out the little paper the little paper cup. Fill that cup. Open up the pot, drop the pot, pour the water. Pshhh. Look out your window, read the paper, soak in the sun and meditate. Boom, Pshhh. cup of coffee. Mm. You get that nice, nice, warm, yummity, yummity, hip hoppity, hoppity, cup of drip, droppity, drop. That's, that's coffee. Craig, Craig, and Craig. Punch a Craig. His name is too close to Craig. And this is a random pack opening with the Buck City Boys, the Buck City Breaker Box. And so we're just gonna talk about random. We're talking about whatever the hell I want to talk about right now. It's coffee. When I die. When I die. I want to be ground. I want to be ground, and I want whoever who whoever killed me, and Tom Brady, and my family, to share a pot of my grounds. Yeah, I want to become my cup of coffee, and I will have consumed so much coffee that I I will have a very robust flavor. And all the, com you know, the chemical c components to be a cup of coffee. So, <clears throat> it'll be perfect. I'm going to actually write that in my will. You want anything from me? You better ground me up. And I, I, I want a diner style pot. I want you to go to a cracker... I want you to go to a Waffle House or Cracker Barrel. I want you to have them make a pot of coffee with my grounds. Everybody get a nice breakfast and maybe a cup of orange juice. If you're not a big coffee drinker, you need Chaser. We're drinking it black, no creamer. And uh, my funeral is just drinking a cup of my ground up body as coffee. Thank you. That's all I want. We can get to this. I think we're opening packs. I think we're going to open some packs. This is random. We're going to, this is random. We're opening random packs. Hello. Hi. And I just want to follow up. Wait, let me take a sip of this. Drip, drop it. Drip. I just want to follow up. We will give away a box of select if we get. Tom Brady on this show, on this program episode, box opening, bonanza, here. And this is the Buck City Breaker box. And this thing you get for breaking with them, then they throw some packs at you because they're kind folk over there. Buck City Breaks, Buck City Breaks. We'll look into this here in a second. What in the butt is this? Looks like we got some baseball, so that's going to be a fun experiment of messing up names and having a good laugh. But yeah, you break with them, and instead of giving you discounts, they give you packs. They give you something to rip. Whoa, a red one. And they give you box cutters. 
I think we just hit a BCB rainbow. Did we hit a BCB rainbow? I heard there's a gold, there's a gold box cover out in the wild. It hasn't been seen yet, but there is a gold one out there. Spread the word. There are gold and diamond studded BCB box cutters out there. Let's see what we got. Let's see what we got. Top loader. A little top loady. And looks like six packs. Basically, you break with them, they'll send you some packs. We did get some football. That's always good. What is Allen and Ginter? Is this like a Mumford and Sons pack? With a specially a special insert may contain three to seven cards. Allen and Ginter. Is this even baseball? Is this cricket? God, this is why I don't that's why I don't watch the sport. I don't know if these are hobby or if these are they usually throw they usually send hobby packs and looking at this with two Allen two baseball this is a fat pack and we got three rookies and stars we're saving football for last sometimes you know they kind of randomize see what packs you get there's panini one yeah, there was some panini one and that is the only time I would ever recommend ever getting panini one you know, you want to spend $600 and get a Jake Fromm RPA out of 125 and lose $550, pretty much guaranteed. Go for it. I'm not. But if they sent me one for, for free, basically, I'd be all about it. Look for winning tickets. I don't know if these are hobby or retail, but we'll just start with this baseball series two. Fat boy. I don't know if this is like a cello. A cello. I, I don't know much or nothing about baseball here. I don't know the players. I don't know. Let's get this mic a little closer. I don't know what we're looking for. Derek Fisher. Frankie Montas. Kyle Tucker, Kyle Seeger, Mr. Hoskins, Seaman, Sutter, Lowry, and these all look, they all look base. Nothing too special about this. I'm going to grab this mic here, move it a little out of the way. Oh, there's something shiny back there. I don't know if y'all see the very back card. The back card is shiny. And if this mic, with the audio doesn't sound great, it's because I'm trying the mic in a different spot and I don't know how it's going to sound or how loud I need to talk. So bear with me. Bear with me. Bear with me as we get through this massive pack of just... Boring, boring baseball. This is not a baseball channel. We're only doing this because BCB has sent them. I'm not going to read all these names. And I'm not going to look at all these cards. Let's see if there's something shiny. That's about... Is this back? Is this upside down? What is... What kind of card is this? Edwin Diaz is not a name I would recognize, and these are not numbered. Oh, I think that's a good name. Why do I think that's a good name? I've heard, oh, I know who Randy Johnson is. Now we're talking about people I know. If there's somebody that can smash a bird with a ball. There's a sticker that says 35. I, Soto, I, feel like I've heard before. I've heard rumblings. Rumblings in the distance, deep in the mount. Rumblings in the deep. That soda's soda good. And, bro, look at that hair, that stash, that nose. Wow. And again, y'all let me know if I just skim through something. I don't know who Edwin Diaz is. I really don't. 
If y'all see anything valuable, y'all cannot tell me, but I won't put it on eBay because I don't know anything about baseball. Y'all can just tell me, and then we'll move forward with something. But otherwise, it all looks like baseball. Now, what in the butt is this? What is that man wearing? On his head, eight cards. Allen and Ginter. Who was Allen? And who was Gint Ginter? Is that another Randy Johnson? This is another Randy Johnson. The, uh, and I still hope you can hear me. These look cool. These are fun. Should probably look at the names, but I think these are all base. Whoa. Pink Opal digging deep. What? 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 BCB, what is this? What is this picture of a rare jewel on a card? Pink Opal. I think that's my birthstone. But what is this little dude? It's a mini. A mu Mustakas mini. Mike Mustakas mini. It's so small. That's interesting. I don't even know what to do with that. Wow, what a weird pack. This is weird. I'm enjoying the oddity of this. Oh, we got something blue. Maybe we have a sapphire something. Mr. Fried, just fried, and he looks fried, if you know what I'm talking about. He looks fried when he took that picture. Thanks. Kershaw, I know that's a name. Giulietto. Alfaro. McGovey. Oh, another little mini. Steinway Tower. What is this? What am I opening? I thought this, it's not baseball, it's architecture and, and jewel diggers and minis. Ben Nintendo. N uh, I'm, I'm over it. This is why I don't touch baseball. All right, we have three. What I can confirm is hobby, rookies and stars, 2013. You know who's in 2013? I don't know a lot of them. But I know DeAndre Hopkins is. That would be a fantastic rookie. And when I say in 2013, I mean rookie class. That rookie, there's some other names. There are some other names. I don't believe there's any other quarterback names rookie-wise. But there are some decent players. There are some decent players. Quell Jackson. Colin Kaepernick, Randall Cobb, and our in, an insert here, NFL Nation, David Wilson. Marcus Wheaton, rookie card. Marsh Beast Mode. One of the best times you will ever spend on YouTube is watching Marshawn Lynch and Rob Gronkowski play Mortal Kombat on Conan. Not gonna lie, one of the best, Matt Ryan, too, one of the best YouTube videos there are on the internet. I have rewatched it so many times. If Marshawn Lynch was a rookie now, Marshawn Lynch stuff, it's kind of hard to collect at this point. I would do it if he was kind of more in the lead at the moment. Chris Johnson, 2K. Cameron Wake. Fred Jackson. Uh, I like that name. I like when I see a little bit of Drew Brees. Brees. I apologize for that. Game plan, Drew Brees. 
not numbered. I will set that there though. A rookie Darius Slay. That's a player. Another Drew Brees. Charles Tillman. And a Ben Roethlisberger. Uh, the fact that we haven't, we've opened two of these and we haven't seen a numbered card makes me wonder if this is hobby or not. But so far we have not seen anything great out of this. A filler, Tony Romo. Dad and Skecher wearing extraordinaire, Tori Smith. I believe this is just a filler. It's a nice filler. The best thing I think we've gotten out of all this is a nice filler. Some Giants quarterback, Alfred Morris, Greg Jennings, Jonathan Stewart. Okay, legitimately nothing, and I don't know anything about the baseball, but the football was an absolute dud. But, this true breeze is kind of cool, I guess. Anyways, this was random. This was a random pack opening. You know, get ready for some select. Again, I now will say it. Thank you for just being you. And if we get Tom Brady, if we get Thomas Edward Patrick Brady to call into this show, I will give away a box of select. A whole box. All the packs. But we're also going to open a box of select on this channel. And... Gunning for some Chronicles and Optic Contenders. Am I going to open... Uh, I mean, I got this Opal. Maybe I can sell this Opal for a box of National Treasures. Uh, but no, I can't. Because guess what? I need my kidneys. I need my kidneys. I already sold one of them to get a box of Select. There's no way I'm priced out of National Treasures and Flawless. So, we didn't open Panini 1 because it was Panini 1. And we didn't get in case because honestly, I don't like Panini's packaged products where they're already graded and already cased, and that's kind of the selling point. I think that's a bit. I think that's it's a bit hacky. So we're not gonna open this. Anyways, peace. Like this video, you idiot, and don't forget to subscribe.